First thing, everyone, welcome to this commentary, and I apologize for the start, because my PBR rec started recording a little bit late, I forgot to click record, so I missed the first kill, but thank god the rest of it actually started recording, because this gameplay is going to be entertaining, I promise you'll enjoy it. Anyway, Pick 6 back, bringing you what is a Spaz 12 only free for all in Modern Warfare 2, my favorite of the Call of Duty games. This, uh, this is one where a shotgun actually works. Unlike Modern Warfare 3, where it's complete trash, underpowered, and lesser opponents get kills with other guns. So, I only really play Modern Warfare 3 when anyone wants to play it with me now. Otherwise, I s stick to this or Battlefield, my two favorite games at the moment. I get the most enjoyment, and I, I, I post some pretty fucking good gameplays if you guys aren't my channel. So, I'm glad you guys enjoy it. Anyway, what I wanted to really talk about today at all was uh, the NFL results over the last weekend or so. Pretty frustrating for me, being a Ravens fan. I didn't enjoy it. Um, I, t the two biggest plays that I'm still I'm still angry talking about it. You can tell in my voice. I t Lee Evans dropping a sure touchdown. And I know a few of you that watch the games, if any of you do at all on my channel here, You'll probably say, oh, well, the Patriots defender battered it out. It was not a drop, pick six. Believe me, that's a drop. If, because th they ran a sports science special on it, and they say his arm was 180 degrees, he didn't get a good swipe at it, so he barely tapped the ball, and the velocity on the spin actually knocked the ball out. But I'll tell you this, me, as a guy that plays football a lot, most other players in college, high school, if you manage to actually secure the football falling backwards and your two feet are about to touch down in the end zone, that's a grab. And considering that he is in a situation where if he secures that football, you go to the Super Bowl, I don't care what it takes. You fight with your life to make sure that anyone bigger, smaller, twice as fast, clawing at that ball, you secure it with your career on the line. And he had the chance to secure it. That's a catch that he, that he himself... In a non-pressure situation, it's going to make 90% of the time. So, you have to understand a drop like that that costs your team a chance to go to the Super Bowl. And what I felt was a sure win against the Patriots to drop it. Inexcusable and extraordinarily frustrating. Oh, and Billy Cundiff missing the kick. You, you got to make that kick, but... The other thing is I sort of put that one on Harbaugh because the situation was rushed. He had another timeout. You call the timeout, you take your time, you set back up, you send the thing to overtime, and you go from there. There's there's no reason to rush. Just be patient. You're the, I, I think the Ravens were the better team, and I think they lost the game for themselves. The other game that was on was uh, Giants-Niners. Neither of them. Not I'm not really a big fan of either of them, but I do respect them, and I did watch the game. And that's another situation. People were pinning the loss on uh, backup punt returner Kyle Williams' fumbles. But, again, I don't think you can pin it completely on him because they were 0 for 13 on offense on third down conversions. That is an extremely telling stat if you're a football fan. It's inexcusable is what it is. Y you can't go 0 and 13 and expect to win. Kyle Williams' fumbles didn't help, obviously. But, come on. Over 13 on third downs, you cannot pin it on purely the punt return, man. It's inexcusable. But, yep, that's... Needless to say, it'll be a rematch of the 07 Super Bowl, Giants-Patriots. And this time, neither of them are undefeated, so... It should be interesting for most people, but for me... I'm gonna watch it with my friends, drink some beers, but... To be honest with you, I'm not really gonna enjoy it too much, I don't think. Because I don't really like either team, so... Either way, yeah, I'll end up watching it, but I, I don't have to enjoy it. <laughs> uh, wrapping up this game here, the Star Killer guy that I just shotgun right in the back beautifully there. <laughs> he was raging hard this entire game. But again, his fault. He chose to quick scope. I chose a shotgun in close quarters. Well, and not only did I win the match, I thoroughly embarrassed him, and I love doing it. So. Excuse my voice if it's a little raspy. I was out late last night. And that concludes this. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you later.